Hey, what's up, Brazilian Health Nut Tribe? Bruno Gama here. And today I'd love to talk to you about this super important subject that is hydration, water consumption, okay? So, first of all, the benefits of drinking water. We know we all should be drinking water. And the main benefits, I mean, there are so many ones that we could be just talking here for minutes just about the benefits, but it controls your body temperature, it removes waste from your body, it also transport nutrients across the cell. So many benefits, right? So you know already that you have to have water in your diet. The second point here that I would like to cover is about the quality of the water. That's huge and that's very important as well because nowadays there is so much crap in the water that you cannot really trust any source of water. So you have to do a, a little bit of research to know where you're getting your water from. Uh, you can go to the internet and find some good brands of mineral water or my best option for you is to get a good filter okay so get a nice filter for your house or even some ones that you can take with you when you're traveling so it's super important to have something to filter your water so you get good quality water okay that's the second point here about the quality of the water I actually remember watching a documentary when I was in New York City they did a little test about the different brands and also with tap water from New York which is considered one of the best ones and they found out on a blind test that actually most of the mineral waters that you buy in a bottle are actually the same quality as a tap water from New York so you know my best option is either to get a really good brand that you can trust or filter cool the third point here is about how much water should you have on your day I get these questions all the time and it varies it, it really depends on uh, different things first of all is are you super active so are you on the summer where you are sweating all the time or are you in the winter time where you're not doing much activity so that's it's a huge thing you have to pay attention to so if you're sweating a lot of course you have to drink more water but a good formula here that I like to use pretty simple is about taking your body weight divided by two and that's the number of ounces that you should be having in your day so let's say if you're 100 pounds okay so you divide by two that's 50 and that's 50 ounces that you have to have in a day at least however there is a big caveat here okay the consumption of diuretics and that's coffee tea juices alcohol so all those things are diuretics they make you need more water into your diet so let's say if you're having one cup of coffee a day what do you have to do to increase this consumption consumption of water you actually have to add 1.5 one cup and a half of water on top of your your level your basic level that I just talked about on the formula okay so if you're drinking a lot of diuretics you must have more water in your diet okay so yeah that's it pretty much today uh, water is a huge subject and I think actually is the number one deficiency in the USA nutrient deficiency in not it's not vitamin D it's not any other thing it's actually water surprising right something very essential to your life it's because I mean, my opinion is because a lot of people are drinking a lot of diuretics and they're not drinking water instead okay so yeah make some priorities in your life to have some more water in your diet so I'm gonna leave you with this beautiful view here of Florianopolis cool island right there in the background so let me know your opinion how are you dealing with the subject of water super important are you having enough and don't forget to visit me on brazilianhealthnet.com okay i talk to you later guys peace